Hey y'all and welcome. Come on into our kitchen. Well, I'm solo today because hubby's at work and I'm preparing supper. But I thought I would make a quick video because I was wondering about, you know, if you've ever been in a restaurant and you've seen these little uh, cornbread muffins and you're probably wondering, you know, how, how do they make those? And sometimes they can be intimidating cooking with cast iron. So I was going to give you my secret on how I make them. My first secret when I make cornbread, I use Jiffy. So really it's just a, I think it's a 50 cent box of corn muffin mix. You follow the directions, all you got to add is an egg and a third cup of milk. I mean, you can't beat that. Um, a lot of times you can get, like I said, two of these for a dollar. So that's going to be our first secret for making these cornbread muffins. So let me get my batter mixed up here. So hold on just a moment. Our ingredients mixed up here in a bowl. And you're just going to follow the instructions. Uh, one pack of Jiffy, one egg, and a third cup of milk. And you're going to stir it until it's all combined. You know, make sure it's all mixed up good, all that dries, combined. Now that I've got it all combined, I'm going to let it sit here because it's like it almost rises a little bit. And you're probably wondering, where's my cornbread skewers? Well, they're actually heating up in the oven. So, you actually want to go ahead and get your cast iron corn uh, muffin pan and put it in the oven and let it be heating up while your oven is preheating up to 400 as the instructions say. That way, once it's preheated, your pan is good and hot, and then I'll show you how we're going to fill them. I'll be back in a minute, folks. All right, so these, this literally just came out of the oven, and this is popping hot. What you want to do now is get you some Baker's Joy. This is a guarantee that they will not stick. And you are going to spray these very well because you want all these little nooks and crannies to get some spray. I've had better luck using this spray than just using the old fashioned butter. So now we got our cornbread. We're just going to fill these up. You do not want to overfill them. So I'll literally just go to the line. Usually one package of Jiffy is enough for the small pan. Yep, looks like it's going to be just enough. Finished my bowl. You can look at your instructions. We're going to put these back in the oven. I'm going to start with about 15 minutes. We'll be back. All right, y'all. I got our little cornbread muffins out of the oven. I did go ahead because they started uh, getting together and I put me a knife through there so it'll get out easier. 
So let's see here. Oh, look at that. Popped right out. We had a little issue there. Ah, he's so hot, people. I'll have to sample him. To go in lightly so they don't tear because they're delicate. See, he went out. So use a little, lift it up a little bit here and then lift it a little bit here so they don't stick because they'll rip on you. Look at that. All this steam's getting my sinuses going. All right, there we go. You can kind of hear it when you do it, when they unstick. This was 15 minutes at 400. So there you go, people. You want just some uh, little cornbread muffins like they do in the restaurants? You want to use you some Baker's Joy? And a box of uh, Jiffy Cornbread mix, and you're good to go. If you like this little video, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe, and let me know if you try this, and if it was easier for you as it was for me. Thank y'all. See you later.